Where are you parked? I took a cab. Well, get in. I'll give you a lift. No, no. Besides... What? I think I'm going to go to a bar. What? I know, I know. It doesn't make any sense. But I got to go. I got to. My feet's is taking me. They scream and play a little, be bad a little, do the man thing. <laughs> oh, God. I've had one too many. And I can't believe I'm asking you for advice. Yeah, me either. Maybe you are crazy. Yeah, maybe I am. Well, once you get in, I'll give you a ride there. No, no, I gotta walk. Give my higher self a chance to change my mind. Call me tomorrow and fill me in. All the pathetic details. No, I just want to make sure you're okay. You okay? Sure. Really? Look, I know who I am. And if I'm there for an hour and nobody wants a pudgy middle-aged man, I'll survive. Been there, done that. An outside chance, I'll have a good time. And if I'm supposed to meet somebody, I'll meet somebody. Either way, I swear, I won't go home and jump off the building, okay? You better not. Besides, it would just be nice to touch somebody. Yeah, I know. Hey! Take a bottle of water. Okay. It's on me. Welcome back. Thanks, Steve. Mike. Michael. <laughs> Buy a drink? Sure. Rum and Coke. A rum and Coke in a bottle. So what do you do? Not a mason. Bricks? Right. <laughs> Between jobs, though. What about you? Well, I'm on a spiritual journey. Seconds flat. I don't know, I just walked in and there you were. Same here. It's like I didn't even see anyone else. Me either. But why me? You seem nice. said you're on a spiritual journey. Mm -hmm. Since you said that, I know I can't do what I was going to do. I'm not a priest. What were you going to do? Kill you? I was gonna kill you. You were gonna be the first. Why? I don't know, because I had. I just knew I had to kill someone, and when I saw you, I knew it was you. hate people. They suck. Life sucks. Because I'm fucked up, Mike. Really fucked up! Really fucked up! It's my little girl, Samantha. That's her mommy, and that's me. Beautiful family. That was a year ago. I fucked that up. I fucked them up. See that? Look at it. You see it? Look. They left me. They had to. Where are they now? Her parents. Do you see them? 
No, fuck no. Her fucking parents, I fucking hate them. They got a restraining order against me, so no, I can't see my little girl. And I got fired because I got all fucked up and I've been on the streets for months. And it's hell. It's just what I deserve. Is there something I can do? What the fuck could you do? I don't know. Fucking nothing, that's what. Fucking nothing. So shut the fuck up. Shut up! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I get so angry. I don't know what to do. I'm so scared. I don't, I don't want to hurt you. I trust you. Why? Why would you trust me? I didn't know why I went to that bar tonight. I haven't been there in over a year. I was never going to go there again. But tonight, my feet just led me there like I had to be there. Me too. And we both arrived at the same time, and the only one I saw was you, Michael. Same here. Is there any doubt that we were supposed to meet tonight? Do you think there was anyone else at that bar? One person, even? That would have said what I said? Spiritual? Yes. I don't even know how or why I said it. It was like I didn't say it, but the words came out of my mouth anyway. Why? Because you needed to hear them? Before you go, can I please just hold you for a while? No sex, no games. Just hold you. Please. Michael, take the money. Thank you. You're welcome. You saved my life tonight. Daphne. Hi, it's me. I just wanted to tell you. I touched someone. <laughs> 